Hi, Assalamu alaikum, peace be upon you. You might have heard uh, that many doctors and experts are suggesting that we keep an eye on our blood oxygen saturation level uh, during this COVID-19 pandemic. So uh, many uh, are actually buying um, pulse oximeter, uh, a device that helps us to uh, measure our blood oxygen saturation level. Uh, I'm going to show you today uh, another way how you can measure your blood oxygen saturation level uh, using a, a smartphone. This is Samsung Note 4. I bought it uh, roughly six years ago. Um, I don't use it anymore. It's just lying around. Uh, so this phone has got a feature in it um, which will help you to measure your blood oxygen saturation level. Um, there are many other models um, that have this feature. Uh, you can see that there's a um, sensor over here and you put your finger on this uh, sen sensor and use the app um, and then measure your uh, blood oxygen saturation level. Let me show you how to do that. So you see that there's this app called Samsung Health. You just need to tap on that app and when it opens you can see that you can do a number of things. You just need to go down and you'll see that there's a uh, there's an area where it says you, you can measure your uh, oxygen saturation level. It says place your finger on the sensor. So you just you just need to put uh, one of your fingers um, on the sensor, and you'll see that the uh, it will light up the red light and starts to measure your blood oxygen saturation level straight away it says measuring so you just to you just need to uh, wait it doesn't take long here you go it's done it says 100 percent which is good so this is how you can measure your um, blood oxygen saturation level in no time using your uh, smartphone um, and also you can save it also you have the option to select the state in which you are uh, at the moment um, for example if you're running or doing some exercise or you're just you know uh, relaxing so I'll just select uh, general and hit save so yeah so it's done uh, that's how easy it is you can also track uh, how you're going and see if it's actually increasing or staying stable over time and you can see that if it gets below 95% you need to be alarmed and when it gets below 90% that's when you need to be hospitalized so that's all uh, take care. Thanks for watching.